much you can do is uh, try to look at a couple different scenarios depending on how, how you're running and where you're running at the end of a race and try to try to pick a couple different ways you would do it. And, you know, that's about the only way you can really prepare for it. And, uh, it's up to the driver after that. Is it, can you look at your old notes from previous races to do that or is it well, I mean, you can look at some of your old notes and uh, it'll help you get set up for the race, but for the ending of it, you know, it kind of always depends on how you were running, and whether you want to take a gamble to try to get a spot or whether you want to put four tires on and, and be safe and uh, feel like you can probably win the race or, you know, something like that. So it all depends where you're, where you're running on it. So it pretty much comes down to how you position if you're going to take four or two. Yeah, I mean, it really, like I say, if you're running up front all day, then it's a lot easier to put four on, whereas if you're running in the middle, then it's, okay, do I do two to try to get a little couple extra spots or do I do four to guarantee where I'm finishing, you know, and you know, you guys might do none. So it's, a, it's a, all about luck, and uh, some of it is you got to try to think, like, what your competitors are going to do, so you don't, uh, you know, if you do four and uh, 20 cars do two, it didn't really do you much. I think everybody's going to wait and see what, how they run in Texas, and, uh, you know, we got a lot of work to do. I mean, I feel like a really good Charlotte test, but, uh, you know, Texas is a little different racetrack, and, uh, you know, the, the spoiler's going to change the game a little bit, and, uh, you know, we'll hopefully we'll be one of the guys that adapt really quick and uh, you know, hopefully come out of Texas with a win. Is there anything that you're working on now for the other tracks ahead, like Darlington or anything that you can work on, or is it, let's just wait and see what happens? Well, I mean, I think we're working on, uh, you know, going to the wind tunnel and, uh, you know, trying to improve the cars, uh, little little stuff until we uh, see what happens in Texas. But, uh, you know, they've changed the rules even since the last time. We, you know, right before the Charlotte test, they changed it to a three and a half inch with the fan and fan. Deck lady down the window, so, uh, so we'll just keep waiting and see what this, something might change again after Texas, so you don't want to get too far ahead. Uh, it's different for, for everywhere we go, really. Um, all the tracks have certain things that kind of stand out, whether it's a lot of tire fall off or um, just the way that it, it normally pans out at the end of the races. But in a lot of the places, when, it, when it, you get a caution, like Talladega, you're not going to come, you're going to try to keep the track position, and, and a lot of the places that the, the tires are going to fall off, um, you're going to stay out and try to keep the track position. At a place like Phoenix, where they had the green white checker, do you take, do you come in, do you take four, do you take two? Well, you, you basically got to come in, the tires fell off a lot at Phoenix, and uh, we, we opted to take four, and then when we you know, had our worst stop of the night, actually, and, um, a lot of those guys took two and, and two won the race, so um, it's just a gamble, you know, it just really depends on how it plays out and if they get the, you know, if you end up getting the race in the first go around or if you end up having three shots at it, the guys with four tires are going to win the race, so um, you never know with the, with the restarts the way they are now and having the option of doing three of them at the end, um, it can play out anyway. So it's kind of a wait and see sort of thing? Well, I mean, you just got to make your best your best shot at it, and sometimes it falls your way, and sometimes it doesn't. It just depends on if you get a caution. And if you do get a caution, uh, the guys with 